energy check-in. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. Because oh, it's an energy check-in. Virgos, this is going to be short and sweet. Okay. Plus, okay, I have something to announce. As Today is a magical day. The veil is thin, right? But I'm not making my witch's brew today. Okay, that's in a different past life, you know, when I used to live in Salem. But there's something that I practice when it's the, one, it's Diwali. And it is also um, the Hallow's Eve, right? Okay, so I'm going to share with you something, a little magic that I do. And one second, Virgo. Energy check-in are really just tapping into an energy. We'll see what, oh, so made sound. <laughs> Now, focus, Virgo. You see that penguin? All right. That's a penguin, by the way, guys. I always look at one of the penguin has no head. Like, and then everything is blood. And then, oh, it was a long, like years. And then I look at it closely. Oh, wait, it's a penguin leaning another. And then those are hearts. So they say, okay, what our mind is, is what, it, what you know, what we see is basically what we are. Because I saw the, the penguin ate the other penguin. It was brutal. Um, no, it's not. Okay, so there's a key. Okay, I love this. Especially like right now when the when the veil is thin. Okay, so we're going to tap into your soulmate, right? So you have loved this person. If I look at the nodes in the chart, Rahu is in the seventh, Ketu in the first house. This brings a soulmate. Yes. New one though. Not from the past life. Rahu is about the future, the new. So, um, if the Virgo is wondering right now, you're wondering soul, yes, the answer is this is your soulmate. They have the key to your heart. You know, it's like normally, yes, there is like that part where they do add to the happiness in your life. I don't want to be like you're so focused on them where they are the happiness. They are part of it, okay? Because we need to practice a healthy way of loving someone you know it's like yeah they make you happy but they're you know like kfc still makes you happy no that's me oh, i love kfc okay. i'm sorry okay so here we go let's see not sponsored no let's see i do like popeyes and churches as well okay magician Woo! okay what's this okay people are not stopping okay magician Okay, the veil is thin. Can I just teach you to do magic then today? Oh. <laughs> the magician is wielding things into come into reality as above, so below. What you believe in, what you you know, what your mind thinks, you know, you create. So the magician right now with the soul meat, you're you're really creating this um, connection. It's like I want it, I want it, I want it. Uh, so there's a, yes, there is desire, but not in an unhealthy way. I don't think so. This is mercurial. They're trying to be smart. Uh, you have the pentacle, the swords, the wands, you know, and, you know, the cup. You're choosing love. So the Virgos are saying this time, it's like, I want to choose love, Sal. I want to be like you, Sal. So in love every day. Yes, I'm very much, very, very, very much, of course. Like, if you want this kind of energy, I will teach you in a little while, okay? I just need you to get a Sal shoes. <laughs> if you don't know what Sal, it's an energy drink, all okay. right? Two of cups. Oh, my God. Okay. If you don't get, and I'm telling this to you right now, okay? Twelve cups, so me. Okay. And you're connecting with me. No, 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 no. I'm not, because normally I have, no, 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 no. Uh, you will stay. You will listen to me, Virgo. These two cards right here are not an accident. I want you to share this video to other people, because this is magical. Okay, the connection is magical. Two of cups. It's a soulmate. Mm. Soulmate. Okay. Magician, I want it to L. Okay, got you, I got you. Okay. We'll wield it to reality. Okay. I love this. Okay. Now, the Two of Cups, of course, is two loving union. Okay. And it's 78 cards. This is a different deck, guys. But you see the consistency. And even in your um, astrology, right? If I... If, let me see. Okay. Because this is, this is when the veil is thin. And, you know, new moon, Diwali, okay. You know, you guys cannot see it. But Rahu and Ketu, can I zoom this? I don't know how. Okay, normally you can. So, yeah. So, the Rahu in Pisces, which is your seventh house, really activates this for you, okay? Now, every time, okay, the node. So, the last time that Rahu was in there is 18 years ago. So, I wanted to rewind who you were with or if you were with someone or what happened during 18 years ago 
But half of that, right, nine years, okay, because it's, you know, the nodes move half also before full. Um, nine years ago, again, look at back at the situation, what was happening, because that's what it does. So right now, when you watch this, it's 2024, rewind nine years or rewind 18 years, and you will see that there is something significant as far as like relationship is concerned. And that, my friend, is a soulmate, okay? Every time you get this chance. Now, the chance can be, of course, like, oh, it keeps repeating, but it doesn't repeat again for, for now, another nine years. So this is very, very crucial for you to manifest, right? So this is two souls, okay, Virgo, that really do belong for each other, loving each other, caring for each other, building that love, okay? And you will experience this in a very ethereal way, very magical to a point where you feel, magician, that nothing is impossible. Right. Right? Okay, so that's a magician. Now, at your service, okay? Let me, let me teach you because it's a magician here. Okay, and this is, for, this is for a few. One, two, three. Three people who is connected with me right now who is so glued about. Because you're in love and they're in love with you. Okay? At the night of the Diwali, which is the new moon, it's also Hallow's Eve when the veil is thin for the West, okay, is when I do this ritual. Okay? I light 13 diyas, 13 lamps. You saw it, right? And I'm creating this each night, okay, all the way until the 1111 portal is open. So you see me. You see me where I'm going this? Have you seen 1111? Have you seen the synchronicity? Okay. How magical it is. An angel number, right? So I'm making this. You have to tell me your intention. Okay. It's super seven and then with a jade. Now the super seven has seven gemstones inside it. Okay. Removal of obstacle in love. Bringing in that connection. Career. Opportunity with the, with the jade. Of course, business and success. But it's very transformative. It will it break walls, barriers, the things that you want, that you cannot, that you feel like you cannot. It gives you that path all the way, of course, to 1111. And here, as a remedy, I'm giving you two Lemurian crystals, which is this one. You see me, okay? I have my Lemurian, right? Every time, you would see me in my desk. Uh, it's been with me for ever since I started. I got this in Santa Fe, New Mexico. Uh, there's a magical way on how I got this. But anyway, so I'm giving you two. One for you, and you give one to the other person. Not If you want to do your soulmate, yes. But I want you to give it to a person who needs help. You don't have to tell them, hey, you have it, you need help. Not like that. You give it as a present, as a gift. But your intention is to help them. Okay? Because as a remedy, which is right now, you know, very auspicious because it's Diwali. Okay? When you help others, you know, you be the light. And then, the, you know, you help the others. And then the light comes from the divine and answers also, you know, gives you the solution to your problems. If it's a relationship or money like that. So use those, okay? It comes with it, okay? You will get, receive it. It's a it's a smaller version of my Lemurian crystal, okay? So that's that one. Free shipping in the U.S. and we ship to more than 90 countries across the globe. So I do the ritual every night. So if you order the day, then of course it's the night. And then, but you have to tell me the intention Okay, in the notes, in the checkout, when they make your Super 7. Okay? Your 11, 11 bracelet. Okay. So, coming back to the read here, I just got so invested with your soulmate, okay, especially the, the one who's connecting with me, who's I'm tapping into the energy here. I'm so invested right now. Okay, so you want to work it. Okay. You want it. You want it. Eight of Pentacles. Uh, so, that's your focus. To work the connection. Oh! I love it. It's divine. Sold, Sal. Give me 10 of those... You want 10? I got you 10. Okay, I'll make one. The star card. I told you. The cards will never lie. Nine years, rewind. 18 years, you could have waited. And the time has come. You don't want another nine years. You don't want another 18 years. So let me help you manifest it. Some people are scared to do magic. It's, magic is normal. It's like working out, doing Pilates, doing yoga. It's like, do you do magic? I do. I do every day. Okay. Look at that. This is this is the most magical read ever for the Virgo. I love you know that can I just a little bit, you know, say uh, I'm off script over off the topic of the topic. When I did my meetup 
with more than 300 people. And I asked, which are each sign? It was all Virgos, majority, more than half. I felt betrayed by the Scorpios. No <laughs> Scorpios were hiding. <laughs> no, it was majority were Virgos. Okay. Yeah, more than half of the room. Okay, you can watch it. You have the star, the soulmate. Oh, and this is being wishes granted, right? Fulfilled. As above, so below. So that Rahu in the seventh can give you this. For me, I work with Rahu a lot. And during the night, the, the time that you're watching this, I will work with you if this is something that you're manifesting. You just have to tell me in the notes when you check out because your wish has been granted. I 